Hey you guys, this is the big week. Prom is coming up this Saturday and my dress just finally arrived today. It actually wasn't supposed to arrive until next week but I've been harassing the company to get to me on time and my prom dress just arrived. Just came in the mail, it's super heavy, it's in this bag and I cannot wait to try it on. I am so excited and I will admit, I took a bit of a gamble with this dress I ordered from a website that I didn't have very many reviews for and it's a little bit, you know, sketchy. I wasn't so sure about it. So this part's kind of exciting to me just seeing if the dress is what I expected and I wanted to share this reveal with you guys just so you guys could be part of this portion of my prom because I'm not really sure how much of the rest of it I'm going to get to show you guys. I mean, I'm going to show you the preparation and everything, but I don't know if you'll see much of me in my dress on prom day. So I figured you guys could be part of my unboxing, if you want to call it that, of my prom dress. <laughs> admit I've had quite a bit of stress just over this dress. I spent a long time trying to decide what dress I wanted to wear, if I wanted to wear my same one from last year, if I wanted to borrow one from a friend. Buying a whole one new was kind of stressful for me and I didn't want to spend a lot of money on it so I actually did buy this from, as I said before, a Chinese website that I was a little bit curious about, just not really sure it was going to be true to what they said they had, but I looked at lots of pictures, read lots of reviews, was in contact with the company multiple times so if it's not exactly what I was expecting I'm going to be very disappointed but it's okay. Now this dress actually is the knockoff, if you want to call it that, of a dress I tried on last year. I'll insert a picture here. I tried it on in pink and I absolutely loved it. Considered buying it for my prom, but I didn't want to wear a pink dress and the only other color they had was emerald and gold. So this year I ordered it in black, which I'm not even sure the color of the dress is really made in, but this company does do it in black. So this is the black version of the dress and I'm so excited to try it on. If it looks how it should, it should have a slight V, a very deep back, be a velvet or you know, even a fake velvet material, be a true black color, and be full length. I did do this to my custom measurements. I'm expecting this dress will fit very well, and I am gonna be a little bit annoyed if I have to get it tailored, but I have plenty of time to tailor it a whole five days, so if that's the case, I'm gonna run off and get it tailored probably right after this. Okay, I shuffled things around so it'd be a bit easier for me to be able to show you guys me opening it up, but this is completely sealed. I have not looked at it at all. It's actually inside out to protect the fabric, so I can't even really tell what the dress looks like, but I am so excited to open it up. I really hope this is a dress that I think I've been getting, but you never know with this kind of website, so I don't know, it's kind of the fun of the video is just seeing if this dress looks like how it was supposed to look. And I'm just gonna go ahead and open it up now. Okay, well the bag broke. That's not a really good sign, but it's okay. Luckily, we do not need to use this bag again. It's definitely like heavy, and I think that's probably a good sign because I think that heavier dresses are generally a better quality. Now I'm turning it the right way around. I'm just trying to find the top so I can hold it up by its straps. Have a nice zipper. Yeah, this basically looks how I thought my dress was gonna look. And it's really long and it's very heavy, like super heavy. So I guess the next step is to try it on and see if it fits me. I don't know, I can't really tell this way, but it's the fabric I thought it was gonna be and it is super nice and like a shinyish black. So I don't know if you guys can tell. Yeah, you can totally tell it has like a gleam of like a velvety black. With my prom dress, I really want to get like a pretty plain dress, but still something that's kind of like formal and pretty and definitely form fitting. So that's my goal. Okay, so I just shoved everything on the floor out of the way so I could show you guys this, but the dress actually looks really good. It had the neckline I imagined. It has the back I imagined. It does have the train, which you guys know is what I was waiting for. And it's actually the exact perfect length of me. I do have my heels on already. I'm going to wear these four inch gold heels that I actually wore last year to prom, but I have no problem reusing things for prom because it's not like that stuff really matters. Really, I think I'll leave a good review for this company because overall this dress is exactly what I thought it was going to be and I'm really, really happy with it. They also sent me a free gift. They sent me, anyway, they sent me this weird choker necklace. I'm definitely not going to be wearing it with this dress, but that's totally fine. I appreciate it anyway. It was a nice gesture. But anyway, I'm actually very, very impressed with this dress. I'm so excited to wear it. I'm definitely going to jazz it up with a fun necklace and a clutch and I don't know what else. My hair, I'm thinking I'm probably going to do in like a 
pony like that, something pretty curly and fun. I already got my prom nails done and I am in love with them. That's probably gonna be it for this video. I am absolutely so excited for prom and I do have my friend Emma coming with me on Saturday so we can vlog the entire day. It'll include hair and makeup and getting the dress on. At that point I should already have the tan so if I have a chance I will vlog the day of my tan so that you guys can see that. But I am so, so excited about this prom. It's my boyfriend's prom, not mine if you guys didn't know that. but. Anyway, super, super excited for it. A little bit nervous, of course, but very, very excited, and I cannot wait to show you guys the entire day. So anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, I would really, really appreciate it if you like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also, you can check out my Instagram, at Juliana underscore Murphy, or at J Murphy Fit if you wanna check out my fitness. But as always, I appreciate everyone who watches my videos, and I cannot wait to see you guys in the next video. As always, leave down below any ideas for other videos I can make for you guys, and I'll see you soon.